Hi guys, welcome back. It's Elsa the Bargain Hunter here. I brought you, I'm bringing you a very unexpected Dollar Tree haul. I stepped out real quick. Oh, my hair's a mess. I stepped out real quick because I had to grab some groceries and Dollar Tree was right next door. Um, I couldn't find the oven cleaner. So I said, let me just check Dollar Tree. So I went in there real quick, and of course you can't go into the altar and just buy what you're meaning to get. You always end up buying more stuff and blah, blah, blah. But I did find, I didn't find the oven. It's really for the stove top. So I'm hoping, I've never used this, but I'm hoping it works because it has bleach. It's the Comet Kitchen Cleaner. I've never tried it. I couldn't find anything else, and the supermarket didn't have what I wanted. So if you guys have tried this, please let me know because I, um, I'm going to have to try it and see if I can finagle something to clean the stove top. I also grabbed two more. I really like these and they still had some left. So I grabbed two more of the scratch art. I did two of those. What? So I did grab two of those. I grabbed my eyes. I'm squinting in case you guys didn't notice. I don't have my glasses. They were broken in the process of visiting the grandkids. And so... Uh, so I have a headache right now. That's why my eyes look so tiny. And I don't have glasses and all this other good stuff. So what I ended up doing, because I've seen it, and I said it might help, is getting, it's called the magnifying ruler. So I grabbed that. Hopefully it'll help me. Because I want to do some stuff between tonight and tomorrow. Um, once again, I forget who hauled this. But I did find them into 73 piece alphabet stickers and there's two different designs. I got this one and I got more of a bluish pinkish kind, two different colors, almost the same design but different colors. So I was excited to have found these. When I went in there Sunday, I realized they still had some... Um, Christmas stuff that was still 50% off So I went in there and I said, you know three dollars worth Being six cards 50 cents each, you know that way next year I'll have these special cards for my sisters and stuff. So I ended up grabbing the six cards <clears throat> Right here just basically Regular Christmas cards the individual ones none of none no sets just individual but you're probably wondering why I did that. Like I said, 50 cents, why not? But then she rang them up. <laughs> there was no line, so I didn't want to hold up the line. And I said, is that right? She says, yeah. I said, do you have a limit on credit card payments? She says, no. I said, I'll be right back. And guys, you're probably wondering why I did this, but you'll see why. I went back and grabbed what I could because Abby was outside waiting for me. So I grabbed 21, I want to say, maybe 20 more cards, Christmas cards. Crazy? Maybe. Why? Guys, now I don't know if it's all Christmas, because like I said, I was kind of rushing, so I just grabbed whatever. I'll probably go back tomorrow. But these Christmas cards, and I'm not sure if it's all Christmas items, but these Christmas cards... Look at this one, isn't this cute? And I like the llama. You guys probably just want me to hurry up and get to the point, right? Santa Claus is on his way. <laughs> All right, guys, enough. Okay, these Christmas cards, believe it or not, guys, um, we're bringing out for a penny. So, heck yeah, I was gonna grab whatever I could and. Heck yeah, I was going to come on real quick and let you guys know because I just got 26 cards for less than 30 cents. And I did, I do have a couple of duplicates, no big deal, because like I said, I just grabbed them, as you can see. I do have duplicates, you know, but who cares? They're only a penny. I'll get this one. Huh. Now, I can't go back. Hubby had to step out. I can't go back to the store because I don't have my glasses. I can't drive at night. But best believe that I will be there tomorrow 
and check out because they still had the Christmas villages the houses for the villages they still had some left this particular store they had some of the boxes and they had a bunch of cards guys you can't tell me that for a penny these cards you're not gonna go and grab some if your store has some left I just like I said I just got 26 cards for less than 30 cents and I'm going back for more because they had two displays the the cardboard displays where they keep the cards you know not in the regular section you remember how the Christmas ones were in a red cardboard display they had two of those displays so heck yeah I'm going back tomorrow for a penny each yes I will go get some and there's look at this one look at that isn't that cute nice looking blue ones the envelopes nicely wrapped none of these have the year on it i don't see why they would check this out i mean i can stock up on these and probably not buy christmas cards if i was to grab all of them if i can get a hundred if i have a dollar in my pocket and i get a hundred of these clear the store out I'll be good with Christmas cards for Lord knows how long. And as my channel grows, I have more people, more subscribers to exchange cards with. So why wouldn't I grab them for a penny? And why wouldn't I share it with you guys? Guys, go check it out. My store here in Massachusetts closed at 10. I don't know what time you guys' stores close, but if you got time and you can call and see if they have anything Christmas left, go over there and check it out because a penny, the cashier didn't even know. So, I was like, is that right? She says, yeah. I was like, okay, I'll be right back. Look at this one. Uh, go. <laughs> That's all I can say, guys. Just go. All right? I will talk to you guys later. No, I'm not crazy. And, yes, I love sharing stuff with you guys. So, run and get your cards. <laughs> and the other stuff I got, too. But that's a dollar. These are a penny. Go. Bye.